Hello everyone, Robert Rambles here, and welcome back to WoW Classic Vanilla and our Hardcore Priest playthrough. Thank you guys very much for joining me today. I hope you're all doing well. Appreciate you clicking on the video and choosing to spend some of your time here with me in Azeroth. I did learn the Greater Wand recipe, so that's the good news. The bad news is we need a Greater Magic Essence. We'll get one of those randomly by disenchanting higher quality greens, so it, it may be a while before we get this. But I have the simple wood we need, we only need one. I think we might be able to combine... I think we might be able to combine. We can, and I completely forgot. Guys, we're good. We're gonna combine three of these four. I forgot that you could do that. I thought we had to wait to randomly get one. Uh, and then, yeah, I remembered we can combine them. So we'll do that when we land, and we'll have a greater wand. And then maybe we can maybe we can ditch enchanting. And uh, I guess it's probably not going to be a skinner here for me to, like, grab that really quick. But, uh, soon maybe. Soon. Yeah, they have a tailor in the crossroads. But no skinner. Not really sure how that makes sense. You'd think somebody in the crossroads would know how to skin a beast. I'm just saying, there's plenty of people setting us out to hunt for stuff. But that's okay. That is just fine. Alright, we are going to get started by hunting the plane striders and some of the quill board here. Let's go ahead and do this. Greater Magic Wand. We are going, let's see, let's do a little comparison. We have 12 to 22 and 11.3 damage. We're going to 22 to 41 and 17.5 damage. So, this is an enormous upgrade. There isn't a wand this powerful that we can get for a while. And some of the ones that are probably come out of dungeons. Uh, but we'll be able to use this bad boy for a, a little bit. Before we head out, let's let's shrink our inventory down. We have some stuff we just don't need to have. All right, that is better, and uh, we are up to a gold, but I don't think I trained level 16. I think I was bad. I don't think I trained. Which is okay. Uh, it's okay. We, we are quite a ways above these guys as far as our level goes. So even if we missed out on any ranks, which we just got a new rank of Smite, we might be due for a new rank of Mind Blast, if I had to, if I had to guess. It's going to be nice to spend some time in the Barrens again. I really, really do enjoy the Barrens. And we were having a great time here on the Shaman before his life was cut short. Let's get a couple things going. And let's try out the new wand. Definitely, definitely going to be good for us. Lots of people here in the Barrens. It's good to see.
I love being on a caster when things run away. It's a really good feeling to have something run away and to not have to chase it down. Just to be like, okay, you go ahead and run. We'll just keep doing exactly what we're already doing. I really want to do some nighttime episodes on this character, I think. I think it would be cool to see these zones that we are in most of the time, to see them at night as well. The day and night looks really, really different in vanilla, and if you have only seen one or the other, it's quite a drastic lighting difference. I think it's 9pm server that it becomes officially, it might even be 10pm so server that it becomes officially nighttime. Kind of just trying to focus this one first to get it done before we move on to the quill bore.
Haven't seen any raptors though, but if we come across any, we need them as well for their heads. I don't know if I want to wander too far, but I guess it's okay. What level is this stuff? Forgotten Pools is 13. Probably should not do that before I do the Quillbore stuff. I do see a raptor up here. Wouldn't mind having a shot at him. We need one more plane strider beak. Let's grab this really quick. There's one raptor head out of 12 down. And there we go. We're seven out of seven. Let's go turn this one in. It's going to chain into Zevra hooves, I think. And we'll be able to pick those guys off whenever we see them while we're doing other stuff. It's good being a little bit ahead of level sometimes allows you to do things that you couldn't do simultaneously. If you weren't a higher level. But we'll see. I, I'm kind of liking focusing the lower level quest one at a time here.
glory to the horde. All right, next, yeah, we're after four zebra hooves next to continue to prove our hunting prowess, but I think we're going to go after some quillbore guys now. I feel like that's going to be a good idea. How is the inventory looking? It's looking okay. Let's go ahead and empty it out a little bit. Strength and honor. Go ahead and disenchant there. We might as well disenchant there. I mean, I, I do plan on dropping it. Maybe I should have just sold the item, but it's fine. All right. Spring. That seems good. that let's head back out Some water seekers over here. Uh, this hunter here does not have a pet yet. Let's go ahead and take advantage of that. Don't see that all the time. Uh, we, we could fight back here and get Chen's empty keg. That might not be a bad idea if we can do it relatively safely. Probably due for some respawns behind us, which I, I don't really like. We do have another player up here who's kind of fighting his way through as well. seeing the keg. Maybe we're waiting on a respawn here. I believe this other player might have just grabbed it. In the meantime, we can continue to fight these guys. Thank <laughs> you. 
Now the keg, we can get that in, in different places. We don't have to get it here. Yeah, we don't have to get it here. We can get it later. We can get it whenever we want. We're going to have a few different opportunities, I think, to find it. Alright, so that's all the water seekers we need. We need thorn weavers and hunters. I was just going to say, where are all the hunters? Well, there's a hunter. Not really sure the best way to deal with these guys yet. We, we might have wanted to take out the pet first. The pet doesn't have a lot of health. So we need one more hunter and one more thorn weaver. Here we go for the thorn weaver. And we should come across a hunter just kind of wandering around somewhere at some point. Let's take a look at the map. It says we're going to have a better chance going back the opposite direction. I, I'd really rather not do that, but... Let's, let's have a peek, since there don't seem to be many available over here right now. Uh, yeah, this is a defender. We don't we don't need defenders. Ugh, okay. Maybe we need to hang out just in this area and m maybe we'll catch some respawns because I, I don't really want to go into the next zone where there are like higher level Quillbore guys. We're going to be headed over there soon anyway. I'd really like this last, uh, any of these hunters just to respawn here. Here we go. Yeah, usually when you don't want the hunters around, you know, they're always a huge problem. But when you're looking for one and then it becomes hard to find. Oh, wow. Alright, so we still need a hunter after all that.
Here we go, maybe this one. This time we're going to target the hunter first. Yeah. Because otherwise, somebody else will zip in and get that initial damage. Let's just burn him down with smite if we can. Uh, we got him, but he, uh, he made some people very angry with us before he went down, so... Let's kind of hightail it out of here, shall we? We got everybody that we need. We didn't get Chen's keg. But, that's okay. I appreciate the buffs. What do you need? Okay, so for the disruption ends, we need Geomancers, Defenders, and we need to find Kreening, Snarl Stout. Not sure if that's going to be what we work on next. No, that's level 15 and level 14. Let's go after Zebra Hooves and Raptors. We'll go look to the south here. We also have to make our way over to the Forgotten Pools. Maybe we do that first. We I don't think we'll find too many Zebra on the way. Well, you know what? I want to go south. Let's go south first and just work on Zebra. I know I'm very, very indecisive today. Probably. Seems that way. And what we'll do is we'll actually start to make our way over to Ratchet, and we'll at least grab the flight point, we have some breadcrumbs over there, and maybe we'll just go pick up all the quests. And see exactly what levels of questing that we're dealing with here in the Barrens uh, that we have access to right now.
noticing that some of these guys are a bit higher level than us. Well, not higher level than us, but higher level than some of the stuff that we've been fighting up until this point. There's a raptor over here. Let's go ahead and grab this guy. We need plenty of heads. Pretty low drop rate on the Zevra, which is typical of the Zevra. It's fine, the more raptors we find now while we're doing this, the less we have to hunt down later on. Yeah, the Greater Wand is incredible. It's it's so worth it to focus that on any caster you're doing on a hardcore run. Do what I did, but do it more efficiently. <laughs> I feel like we could have done better about getting our wand, especially the lesser wand. I had no idea we could make it basically right away. It, it takes basically no materials to make it. Um, and yeah, any caster we, we do going forward for hardcore runs, we're, we're always going to grab enchanting. And we're going to get those wands as quick as we can because it's definitely worth it. Now sadly, not every caster has improved wands. As far as talent choices go. It's four out of four. Uh, I, I'll take it. Let's go back and turn it in. We'll turn this one in, and then we will head out to the Forgotten Pools to the northwest. And we'll get those two done. The raptors are being very generous with their heads, and I do appreciate that.
How may I aid you? We definitely have junk we need to get rid of. And next up, we are after Prowler Claws. Alright, so yeah, we'll head over to the west. And we'll see if we come across any raptors on the way. That'd be great. Same thing with Prowlers, although I think the Prowlers are going to be off in a different direction. We'll head to the Oasis. We'll do some investigation. And we will grab the mushrooms that we need. We should probably pick these up as well. Centaur Bracers and, cent and Kolkar Leaders. We'll grab them. Uh, what's our quest log look like? 17 out of 20. Ugh. Oh, we didn't head to the Barrens. I know, or to the to the Ratchet. I said we were going to head over to Ratchet. We didn't get that far because the we got a lot of the hooves really quickly. Um, hmm. Yeah, we're going to be maxing out our quest log. I could abandon these for now. I, I'm not going to do Rage Fire, guys. I'll do Shadow Thing Keep. I'll do Shadowfang Keep, because as a caster especially, I know there's all kinds of stuff in SFK that we want. There's pro there's definitely probably some stuff in Rage Fire 2. To me though, the risk is not worth the reward. Uh, if I'm going in there, I'm putting my character at stake with people that I don't know. Uh, so yeah, I'm going to hold off. I'm going to hold off until the rewards are a little bit more sizable. The stuff from Aragul's Keep, we can wear that for a long time. That stuff's going to be good for us for a long time, especially in vanilla. So I, I definitely want to go after the stuff in SFK, get that one clear done, and get as much as we can. But I'm not, I'm not, I'm not going to do Rage Fire this time. So we need Centaur Bracers, and we're looking for the first of the Kolkar leaders, Rekthar Deathgate. Those are more long-term quests. We're not going to work on the leader right now at all, I don't think. And as far as the Bracers, we'll, we'll just get the Bracers for now from the guys that we have to deal with. I did mean to set my hearthstone back in crossroads, and I did not do that, so we'll have to do that today. I'm not going to go out of my way to fight the centaur here. We don't have to. We're looking for mushrooms, and we need to swim to the bottom of the lake here to investigate it.
we made it a long time without aggroing anybody. <laughs> Tinted the Rogue, dead at level 27 in Ashenvale. Rip Brother, go again. That's a big one though. That, that that has to hurt. We haven't we haven't got that high up to feel that kind of loss. But hey, we're approaching. We're halfway through 16. We're uh we're doing pretty good. Actually, I shouldn't say that. Should not say that, but it's the truth right now. Alright, we'll head back to the crossroads, and we will get these ones turned in. Doesn't seem like we're going to come across too many raptors up here. I thought there were prowlers over near these trees, but I always kind of get confused about where the prowlers are at. Savannah Huntress, I don't know if this is what we need. I feel like the ones we need are called prowlers. But let's let's have a look. We'll fight a couple of them and we'll see if they drop the item that we need. Oh, well, the, the tooltip would tell me, right? Yeah, the tooltip does not say these guys have the items. Okay, so those are the wrong cats, basically. Sisters watch over. Alright guys, I am going to take a break here. I, sorry, I realized I was on mute as I was explaining my intentions here as we wrap things up. I'm going to head over to Orgrimmar 
And I'm going to learn level 16 abilities and stuff. We'll recap those next time. I think we're going to stay here in, in the Barrens for a little bit. We're probably going to get into level 17 before we need to head back over into Silver Pine. So that is the plan for now. We'll head down to Ratchet next time and check out what's going on down that way. We'll wrap up any green quests that we have going on here, maybe do a couple others as well. And then we'll plan on heading back to Silver Pine, maybe to finish things up there, depending on how much more there is for us to do. Thank you guys very much for being here with me. I am having a blast with these hardcore runs, and the Priest in particular has been a real joy to play again. So thank you guys for the support. Truly do appreciate you. As always, take care of yourselves out in the real world, and take care of each other. And we will see you back here again very soon. Bye for now.